Learning how to get the most out of olive oil's health benefits. People have long known that olive oil is an important part of the Mediterranean diet. But it's also good for you in more ways than one. This golden elixir is full of nutrients and strong compounds that are good for your health in many ways. Let's talk about why olive oil is good for you and why you might want to keep it in your kitchen. One champion of heart health. Olive oil has a lot of monounsaturated fats, especially oleic acid, which is good for your heart in many ways. As part of a healthy diet, eating olive oil may help lower LDL cholesterol, the bad cholesterol, and raise HDL cholesterol, the good cholesterol, which may lower the risk of heart disease and stroke. 2A Powerhouse of Antioxidants Olive oil helps the body fight oxidative stress and inflammation because it is full of antioxidants like vitamin E and phenolic substances. These antioxidants are very important because they keep cells safe from damage caused by free radicals. This lowers the risk of getting chronic diseases like cancer and losing your mind as you age. 3. An anti-inflammatory drug. A lot of diseases, like arthritis, diabetes, and heart problems, are caused by chronic inflammation. Additionally, the phenolic compounds in olive oil are very good at reducing inflammation, which helps ease the signs of inflammatory conditions. 4A Digestive Aid The gentle lubricating effect of olive oil on the digestive system can help digestion go more smoothly and ease constipation. In addition, it may help the body absorb vitamins and nutrients that dissolve in fat, making better use of all nutrients. 5. Help with weight management. It's not true what most people think. Adding a small bit of olive oil to your diet may actually help you lose weight. Although monounsaturated fats are found in small amounts in olive oil, they can help you feel full and satisfied, which can help you lose weight or keep it off. 6. Food for your skin and hair. In addition to being good for your body, olive oil is also great for your skin and hair when you put it on them. Its moisturizing qualities help keep the skin hydrated and soft, and the antioxidants in it may help keep you from getting old too quickly. Olive oil can also be used as a natural conditioner to nourish and improve hair, making it look smooth and shiny. How to add olive oil to your diet. To make a tasty and healthy salad dressing, drizzle olive oil over greens and add a splash of balsamic vinegar. Cooking medium olive oil can be used to saute, roast, and grill meats, seafood, and veggies. Dipping sauce for a tasty starter. Dip toasted bread in a mix of olive oil, balsamic vinegar, and herbs. Finishing touch to improve the taste and texture of soups, stews, or pasta meals. Drizzle them with good olive oil right before serving. You can easily make these three easy and tasty recipes at home with olive oil. 1. What you need for a classic tomato bruschetta. 4 chopped ripe tomatoes, 2 minced garlic cloves, 2 tablespoons of olive oil, 1 quarter cup of chopped fresh basil leaves, 1 tablespoon of balsamic vinegar. Add salt and pepper to taste slice 1 baguette. Here are the steps. Warm the oven up to 190 degrees Celsius. Dice the tomatoes, cut the garlic, chop the basil, add olive oil, balsamic vinegar, salt, and pepper to a bowl. After mixing it well, let it sit for 10 minutes so the tastes can blend. Put the bread slices on a baking sheet and use olive oil to cover both sides. If you want a light golden color, toast the bread in the oven for 5 to 7 minutes. Pile the tomato mixture on top of each slice of bread once they are golden brown. Serve right away as a tasty snack or starter. 2. Vegetables roasted with garlic and lemon. What you need? Diced veggies like bell peppers, zucchini, carrots, and onions into small pieces that are easy to eat. 3 cups of olive oil, 2 minced garlic cloves, 1 squeezed lemon. Add salt and pepper to taste. If you want, add fresh herbs like rosemary or thyme. Here are the steps. Warm the oven up to 200 degrees Celsius. Put the chopped veggies in a large bowl and add the olive oil, minced garlic, lemon juice, salt, and pepper. Toss the vegetables until they are evenly covered. Put the veggies on a baking sheet that has been lined with parchment paper so that they are all in one layer. Roast the veggies in an oven that has been heated up for 20 to 25 minutes. Stirring them once or twice during the cooking time until they are soft and slightly caramelized. 
If you want, add fresh herbs on top before serving. Serve as a tasty side dish or as a main dish over cooked rice or quinoa. 3. Chickpea Salad with Mediterranean Flavors 1 can, 15 ounces, chickpeas, drained and rinsed 1 diced cucumber 1 diced bell pepper. Any color. 1 quarter chopped red onion 1 quarter cup sliced kalamata olives. 1 half cup chopped fresh parsley. 1 half cup olive oil. 1 tablespoon lemon juice, and 1 teaspoon dried oregano. Extra salt and pepper to taste crumbled feta cheese. Here are the steps. Put chopped red onion, chopped bell pepper, chopped chickpeas, chopped kalamata olives, and chopped parsley in a big bowl. To make the sauce, mix the olive oil, lemon juice, dried oregano, salt, and pepper in a small bowl with a whisk. Add the sauce to the chickpea mixture and mix it all together until it's well covered. If you want, you can add chopped feta cheese on top before serving. Serve cold as a crisp and healthy lunch salad or as a side dish with fish or chicken that has been grilled. Enjoy these easy and tasty recipes that use olive oil. Who shouldn't use olive oil? Even though olive oil is usually thought to be safe and good for most people, there are some people who may need to be careful or not use it. If you have an allergy or are sensitive, if someone is allergic to olives or olive pollen, they might also be allergic to olive oil. In this case, eating olive oil can cause allergic responses like hives, itching, swelling, or even anaphylaxis. If you think you might be allergic to or sensitive to olive oil, you should stay away from it and talk to a doctor or nurse for advice. Problems with the gallbladder People who have problems with their gallbladder, like gallstones or a history of gallbladder attacks, may need to cut back on fats, like olive oil. Sometimes, eating things that are high in fat can make symptoms worse or cause gallbladder pain. Getting advice from a doctor or a trained dietitian can help you figure out the best way to eat to deal with gallbladder problems. Thinners for blood. Polyphenols are natural chemicals found in olive oil that may have mild effects on thinning the blood. Even though this is usually good for heart health, people who are already taking blood thinning drugs like aspirin or warfarin should be careful with olive oil and talk to their doctor. If you are taking blood thinners and also eat a lot of olive oil, it might make you more likely to bleed or stop the medicine from working properly. Problems with digestion. Some people with stomach problems, like irritable bowel syndrome, IBS, or inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, may find that high fat foods, like olive oil, make their symptoms worse. In this case, it might be best to limit how much you eat or use lighter oils for cooking and salad dressing. Trying out small amounts and keeping an eye on how your body reacts can help you figure out the best way to take care of your gut health. Babies. Olive oil is generally safe for people, but babies younger than 6 months shouldn't use it. Because babies' digestive systems aren't fully developed yet, they should only be fed breast milk or formula for the first 6 months of their lives. Adding oils, like olive oil, too early could throw off their delicate digestive balance and make them more likely to have bad effects. As always, it's important to talk to a doctor or a registered dietitian, especially if you have specific health worries or conditions that could make it unsafe for you to eat olive oil. If you tell them about your health and food needs, they can give you personalized advice. Olive oil can be used in many recipes and has many health benefits, such as keeping your heart and making your skin healthy. If you drink this liquid gold every day, you can enjoy not only its delicious taste, but also the amazing ways it improves your health and well-being. Thank you for joining us on Herbalist channel today. We hope you found this video informative and inspiring on your journey toward better health and well-being. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos on herbal remedies, health tips, and nutritious recipes. Remember, nature has provided us with incredible healing properties through plants, and we're here to explore them together. Until next time, stay healthy, stay happy, and stay tuned to Herbalist channel. Take care!